I liked, well, the curriculum is, it is very intense. We have, I believe, nine classes. Eight classes. Eight classes. Eight classes, and it's a lot. <laughs> and they have labs incorporated with them as well. Um, so you are in class pretty much from 8 or 9.30 every day until, say, like, 4.30 or 5. So yeah. it is pretty much like a full-time job. That's, um, some days we have half days. Yeah, yeah. Days. yeah. It's it's not, you get the it's, occasional half day, which is nice. Yeah. Personally, I found it, I don't know if anyone differs, but I find it, better to be in so many classes because then I have less time that I have to study when I get home. Um, just because I'm being taught and it's being reiterated in the classes over and over. A lot of time. them are integrated uh, with yeah. each other. So like our biochem and physiology and anatomy at the end of the year, you're like, oh, now it's yeah. all coming together. Like everything fits. Yeah. That so. was my favorite part, I think, was mm -hmm. especially during exams, I noticed it the most yeah. because our exams accumulate yeah. into like studying a big for one class one. was like studying for another class at the same time. Yeah. And really you nice. find when you go back to different classes and finals, you already know this from another class, which is really cool because then you're like, oh, I, don't, you know, I could skip this lecture because I already know it, or just briefly review it, not skip it. <laughs> um, but I think that was my favorite part of the curriculum was mm -hmm. the, yeah. the overlap and the integration. So it's like next year we already have a really good base on what we learned this year because we know everything about the body and how it works. Mm -hmm. And then next year it's like, this is what goes wrong. <laughs> and so I think how it's set up and structured, where it's a lot different than other vet schools because I have friends who are like in there already doing anesthesiology on animals and stuff, but they don't know how that works where we know pretty much how respiration works already. So next year we can learn, build on it. We have a live animal lab for anatomy that the bones and muscles that we learn on the dissections, we actually apply them to live animals too. So that'll be very flexible and, and helpful for later on. For me, I'm a very hands-on person, so I like things when I can see them, when they're right in front of me and I can mess around with them. So Clin Med was such a huge class for me, and it's not a big weight in the curriculum, um, but it was definitely, it helped me a lot to reiterate the concepts that we were learning in physiology and anatomy and you actually get to work with the animals and learn about injection sites and where to take blood from and why you can take it from one vein and not the other and things like that and that was, was a really great hands-on and it's just it's something that they're constantly going over with you and going through with you and it's something that you're going to have to know when you get out into practice as far as how to give a physical exam and how to take blood and how to read a temperature and heart rate and things like that so it was something that was very practical and relevant for me that just made everything else kind of glue together. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.